Have you ever wondered about the role of the royal family in international diplomacy? As figureheads of the United Kingdom, their influence spans across the globe. Their engagements, from state visits to charity work, serve as diplomatic bridges, fostering relationships between nations. Of particular interest is Prince William's involvement in the Israel-Palestine conflict, once pledging to make Middle East peace a lifelong project. His recent actions signify a renewed commitment. Prince William's renewed interest in the Israel-Palestine conflict marks a significant, albeit controversial, pivot in his royal engagements. The Prince of Wales, once pledging to make Middle East peace a lifelong project during his 2018 visit to the region, has faced criticism for what appears to be a lack of sustained engagement with the issue. This promise, made with an air of earnest dedication, marked Prince William's initial foray into the complex world of the Israel-Palestine conflict. Despite the promise, his commitment has been called into question, as critics have pointed out a perceived lack of depth in his diplomatic endeavors. The narrative took a twist when the Prince announced his intention to address the human suffering caused by the war in Gaza. This marked a bold, albeit risky, re-entry into the intricate dance of international diplomacy. His planned engagements with aid workers and anti-hate campaigners are a testament to his desire to use his royal platform for a noble cause, shedding light on the humanitarian efforts in Gaza and fostering discussions on combating anti-Semitism. Yet, the shadow of his past missteps looms large, the comparison to his father, King Charles, brings into focus the high expectations set for him. King Charles has a history of engaging in inclusive multi-faith conversations, setting a high bar for the Prince's diplomatic efforts. As Prince William prepares to delve into the Israel-Palestine conflict once again, his ability to contribute meaningfully to the discourse and to advocate effectively for humanitarian causes remains under scrutiny. This is a delicate dance of royal diplomacy and international politics, and the world watches with bated breath as the Prince steps back onto this global stage. The balance between royal diplomacy and the intricacies of international politics is delicate and the success of William's engagements will likely hinge on his ability to convey empathy, understanding, and a commitment to peace. Tackling the Israel-Palestine conflict is a formidable task, even for a prince. Prince William's approach to such a sensitive geopolitical issue is critical. A nuanced understanding, a genuine commitment to peace, and the ability to foster productive dialogues are essential. However, the Prince has faced criticism in the past for perceived superficiality and lack of depth in his diplomatic endeavors. This has led to an ongoing debate about his capability to fulfill such a demanding role. The comparison to King Charles's inclusive multi-faith conversations only amplifies these expectations. Despite these challenges, the Prince's intention to address the human suffering caused by the war and advocate for humanitarian causes speaks volumes about his commitment. His forthcoming engagements represent a bold, albeit risky, move. The world watches as Prince William steps into the spotlight of this complex issue, his actions and words carrying weight in the intricate landscape of international diplomacy.